السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أهلا وسهلا بكم المشاهدين الكرام طلاب وطالبات مساق علم الأدوية للتمريض في فيديو جديد بنناقش في مجموعة من المالتيبل تشويز كوستشنز اللي بتخص الفارماكوثيرابي أو بروتوزوان أند هلمنتيك انفكشنز وكما احنا معتدين بنستعرض كحالة ككيس استدي وبنشوف بالضبط شو الأجابة الصحيحة بما يخص موضوع النيرسينج ريسبونسابيلتيز uh, أو انترفينشنز في كل حالة من هذه الحالات ونشوف مع بعض the first question a patient is being treated with metronidazole لو بالتريد نيم فلاجيل فور شيارد لامبيا انفكشن وين انستركتنج ذا بيشنت اباوت ذا سترانج ذا نيرس شود كوشن اباوت ذا بوسيبيلتي اوف ويتش ادفيرس افكتس ناو ليت اس سي ذا ادفيرس افكتس اوبشن 1 فلاتوس اند انتستينال بلوتينج كبر على الانتفاخ البطن سكند اوبشن هاليتوزس هي عبارة عن رائحة الفم الكريهة. Third option unpleasant metallic taste اللي هو رائحة الطعم المعدني الموجودة بالفم. And finally alopecia اللي هي عبارة عن صلع أو الثعلبة. The best answer about the adverse effects of metronidazole is number three. Option three is unpleasant متلك تيست وهذا أكيد الشكوى ملاحظة في كثير من البيشنس خاصة مع الهاي دوزز of مترونيدزال let us see the second question a six year old boy is diagnosed with an introbius vermicularis which is pinworm friction and has been prescribed mebindazole famox What appropriate instructions should the nurse give the boy's caregiver? The first option, the drug will be continued for two weeks and then a stool sample will be retested. Or, because the infection is not easily transmitted, it is not necessary to test or treat family members. Third option, eliminate all citrus and dairy products while this medication is taken. And the last option, wash all bedding and undergarments thoroughly after the medication is given. The option number four is the true, it's correct. To reduce the risk of reinfection, bed linens and undergarments. Garments should be washed thoroughly after treatment is given, while the other option is false. The third question: A nurse is monitoring a patient receiving metronidazole flagil for potential adverse effects. Which symptoms, if present, would cause the nurse to discontinue the medication and notify the prescriber? We talk about serious adverse effects. The first one is ataxia and confusion, second nausea and diarrhea, and third option is anorexia and thirst. The option number one is the correct answer. While an acute onset of any CNS abnormality may indicate metronidazole toxicity, ataxia and confusion, if they suddenly developed then this is an indication or signs of CNS toxicity of metronidazole. The nurse must discontinue the medication and notify the provider. Now the fourth option, the fourth question, which information should the nurse include in the education of client prescribed metronidazole? Very much. Select all that apply. The first one generally requires a few days of therapy. Second, high concentration of the drug remain in the intestine. Third option, effectively treats adult parasites. And fourth, the prescription should be taken with a single fat meal. 
Fifth option, treatment of the larva will require a different prescriptions. The best answers are one, two, three, and four. Why the option five is false. Question number five. The nurse is caring for a client with a protozoan infection. The nurse instructs the client that the growing stage of protozoan is termed E1, a worm, or a victor, or a trophozoite, and finally a cyst. The correct answer is trophozoite. It is a growing stage and the active stage of protozoan. The last option, following treatment with Brizaguintel litricide for tapworm infection, the nurse would expect to administer a laxative, a liquid diet, an antacid, and finally yogurt. Please comment your answer and I will be happy to see your comments finally thanks you for watching and see you later in new videos thank you very much